What's going on guys? Anthony here with DragonBallInsider.com. We're here taking a tour of the Funimation Studios here in Texas, Dallas, Texas. Uh, it's going to be a great time. Uh, we're going to be going through, seeing how dubs are made, just what goes on in the Funimation Studio, and hopefully get a nice interview at the end. Uh, look forward to seeing a lot of content. It's going to be a great time and hope you enjoy. What's going on guys, it's your boy Ooch here representing Dragon Ball Insider and I am here with my newest homie, God's Will. Alright, he is from Funimation and we're just going to be asking him a couple questions just about Funimation and a little bit about other animes and particularly Dragon Ball of course because this is obviously why we're here, Dragon Ball Insider shout out. Anyway, so guys, well, tell us a little bit about yourself, um, what's your position at Funimation and like what you like about Funimation. So, um, hi. <laughs> yeah, my name is God's Will. That's really my name. Uh, I've been working for Funimation for three years. I am a social media coordinator. So that means I post on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, YouTube, uh, Snapchat sometimes. Working on Pinterest. Uh, so pretty much everything. Uh, I'm probably missing a few things. But we've been posting on all those pages and working on doing more. I love my job, honestly. Like, you know, I get to geek out about anime as my job with other people. You know, we're constantly posting about are 600 plus titles you know we have 15 20 new shows that come out every season um you know of course we have these huge titles dragon ball super uh just finished its run rest in peace uh, and uh you know like of course the the big boys like one piece that are never gonna go away so yeah what are some of your favorite things about working for the company my favorite thing is probably that you know i've won i get to geek out you know this is something i thought i had to cancel when I was done, you know, like, like, it's like, okay, you're done with high school, no more geeking out, you, you don't, don't do that as an adult, and it's like, hey, I'm an adult, and I get to do that as a job, woo, so that's my favorite thing. As you said, you're a fan, right, of, you know, One Piece, is that, would that be your favorite series, you would say? Oh, yeah, <laughs> no, that's my favorite, for sure, like, um, I just got a tattoo of it, actually, recently, okay. um, on my chest, um, and I've never had a show that has made me laugh as hard cry as much and change my life as much as One Piece. Okay. Like none. Like like don't get me wrong, Dragon Ball Z was very important and like that was sort of started it, you know, my anime kick. But I've never had a show like One Piece that has done anything. Like I remember even like just sitting at a bar. I was sitting at a bar reading a One Piece chapter, you know, waiting for a drink. And then I just had to turn over, start crying. Uh -huh. People were asking me what's wrong. And I'm just like this one piece I can't I just uh. it's, it's an amazing series. So I obviously have to ask you Dragon Ball related questions, specifically Dragon Ball, for the channel, for you know YouTube and the uh, Instagram account, obviously. So, um, how popular do you think Dragon Ball has become over the years, and where do you see it going in the future? So it definitely has become more popular. Like it's for sure is the one that started many people on anime. It's the one that showed that it could be done in the West. It's and it's only gonna get more popular, I think. You know, now that nerd culture is becoming more open. People are more proud to do it. Like you're seeing like athletes like wearing their gear, you know, and talking about it more openly. And celebrities, you know, Michael B. Jordan just said like how much he likes anime. And Dragon Ball Z is the one at the forefront. We have 
hip hop artists that are making songs over or with the content of Dragon Ball Z. Um, and it's becoming more of an international thing where we saw um, people throughout the world celebrating Dragon Ball Super. We saw people um, around the world just being happy about Dragon Ball Super's return and they're much more excited about like everything with Dragon Ball, whether that's the gear, whether that's the movies, whether that's any piece of new, the video games, oh, huge. It's gonna get bigger. That was God's Will. Appreciate your time answering all the questions. Of course, make sure to follow Funimation and to follow Dragon Ball Insider and Uchi Games, and we'll see you guys next time. Hey guys, if you like this video, please consider checking out my other stuff. I do plenty more reactions to and other fun videos. Subscribe as always, and please check out my Patreon page. And I'll see you guys in the next video.